Hey guys, welcome back to South Lake City building, uh, building South Lake City. So, uh, I told you at the end of the last part I was going to change up the entrance to this little metro area down here. And I did buy a, a good amount. And you can see it's a lot different. It looks a lot more like this now. Uh, when this is all done, there's going to be stores and restaurants down here. Uh, so there's going to be like seating areas here, stuff like that. And then right before you guys, or before I started recording, I basically cleared out all this. And this is where the actual subway station is going to go. That's actually, oh, I need to take some more night vision. So basically, that's what we're going to work on now is actually working on this. So let's clear out some of this to make some perfect walls real quick. And then we can actually start working on making the actual subway station itself. Yeah, the, the actual place originally definitely turned for the best i think the way it looked originally just didn't fit this way it gives it more design more depth you can see everything around it so i like that a lot i think that's why i didn't like it originally it's because it was just all one floor so i'm happy i changed it up uh i think it looks pretty good though i actually got some inspiration from another minecraft city so i'm not gonna lie with you guys there it's called greenfield i saw that and kind of got some inspiration from that as well uh, just because some, sometimes trying to find the actual designs can be hard. But I try not to use too many people's designs. Uh, so I try to uh, like put my own twist on it a little bit as well. Uh, so what we're going to do here is let's take out... We need some kind of stone. Let's use... Uh, we could use stone brick stairs again. Or should we just... Let's just use stone. Stone might look a little bit better. Actually, let's just use stone slabs. Well, let's go on busy here. Forgot to do that. Preferences, online status, busy. There we go. Okay. Uh, so where are the stone slabs? Here they are. I think why I like stone slabs so much is because you can kind of see each block and it still looks good. So I think that's one of the main reasons why I use it so much. Okay. And stairs going down one block. Uh, let's put. We want the main. I've looked at pictures of subway stations, and a lot of them have a lot of white for like modern and clean look. So we're gonna go with kind of that theme here. Uh, so we're gonna put another pillar over here. Okay. So we need to have the actual walkway. So let's have these be here. These will be where you actually get on to the actual train station. Like for actually getting on the station itself. And we'll probably have three or four blocks of moving space. So we're gonna have it come all the way over. To, well, we need to extend it all the way out over to this side as well. The train itself, the metro station train, uh, whatever you call it, the metro. It'll be pretty long. I came up with a design I kind of liked because a lot of them, I looked at pictures, they were just really flat and that's just how they're made. But I didn't like that and I couldn't really come up with a good design for a flat one. So I kind of came up with a like kind of like speed train a little bit to kind of mix things up. So hopefully it looks pretty good. Uh, so let's take out some yellow wool for this, which is here. Here it is. The yellow wool would kind of be like precaution. Or should we use orange? Orange might be a little bit better. Let's go orange. Orange has that better look to it, I think. This we're gonna have it come all the way over to this side. Do 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 do. Next, in most stations, they have a lot of these uh, caution lines, and we'll put one more layer of stone slabs right here. And then we're actually going to have the actual station itself, like the actual train in here just in a minute. And I think I'm out of swiftness. Oh, kitty cat, are you tired? My cat's just sleeping away. He's tired. All right, let's make this into a full block here. Jax, why are you so tired? Say hi to everybody, buddy. My Jax, well, my cat Jax has said hi. Well, he didn't really say it. Because he's kind of tired. He's like, just leave me alone. Okay, so we have this here. Uh, let's have like a small little box here. Boom. I've seen boxes like these in the stations before. 
I guess these are like where you wait, I guess. I'm not exactly sure. I've never actually been in a metro station before, so I'm not exactly sure how everything works. Uh, let's have this be here. And we'll actually use stone for underneath here, so... Take the stone out, just regular stone, and we'll go all the way to the other side. Yeah, so far, I'm liking how the city is looking. We haven't done too much up top yet. Obviously, that will come in some later parts. But so far, I think it's looking pretty good. I mean, it's definitely, so far, with... I don't know how to describe it. I don't want to say it's more detailed than Newfield yet, because it's not there yet. But I think it's getting pretty close to being there. Uh, so we still have a ways to go to get it to where it has more detail than Newfield. But I think it is starting to get there with going underneath. We definitely have more uh, detail underneath because Newfield doesn't have anything. That's just because it was on a regular flat map. So that's why it didn't really work. Uh, we're going to have to put... Let's see, what am I looking for? Uh, here we go. Let's use powered rails. I think those might look a little bit better. And have these come all the way over to the other side. Some of these will be gone just because of actual... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like where the train's going to be, we, these won't actually be there. But just for now, we can always get rid of that a little bit later on. Uh, I probably should have put black wool underneath this. Uh, we'll probably test it out, see which one looks best. I think black wool will probably look best here. Uh, let's do this. We're going to have... Should we make this into a two station? Or a one? Because, like, what we could do is have, like, a small little barrier here. Have another one. So this could technically be, like, a four uh, station metro station, I guess. Would be the best way to call it. Oh, Jax. <laughs> Jax, what are you doing? Why are you so tired? You haven't even done anything all day. He's like, eh, just leave me alone. Alright, so we're going to use black wool on this one. I want to see how it looks. I feel like black wool, wool would look a little bit better. Uh, so let's try using black wool. Maybe even bedrock. I feel like bedrock would actually be better. No, I don't like the texture. I'll get rid of that. Let's use black wool. Okay. So two, three, okay. And let's do this again. Let's see which one looks a little bit better. That definitely stone has the cleaner look to it. So that's why I'm not too sure on which one would look better. Oh, my cat turned off my monitor. Hey, you're being a pain. You're like, but I'm cute. Oh, he's so weird. I might put a picture of him up on the screen. We'll see. And I think I'm out of swiftness. No, actually wasn't. And we'll take some more night vision too. Uh, I'm trying to debate what a four station station be too big here. And maybe just a two would be best. Uh, yeah, I think a two would be best. So what we're probably gonna do? Actually, now let's go for. Let's just see how if we can do four. We can always change it up a little bit later. So let's just see how everything looks. Because I don't want to jump to any rational, like, oh, I think this will look best yet. Because I'm not exactly sure, so. Okay. Uh, I'll probably just go through and change one of them later. I'll figure out which one I like best. Uh, let's use orange wool here for safety. And we're probably going to have some pillars here holding up the actual design of the building itself. Which I'm not... I'm thinking an arc shape would be best, an arch. Okay, so we have that. So then what we would do is we'd, we'd have another like main point over here. I kind of wish they just gave us like a full slab block uh, for creative mode. I feel like that'd be the best thing ever because if we want to use anything like this, I, mean, I guess I understand why they don't. Maybe just the stone slab, because that's, this is the only one, I believe, that doesn't turn into a full block. So maybe they should just change this one. Maybe that would look best. Yeah, I think they should do that instead. Just add the stone slab block. Okay, so we need orange wool now. Actually, <laughs> I'm being really indecisive right now. We might just keep this into a two, then have the one in the middle. 
Yeah, because four would be too big for here. It's not the main station. The main station would definitely have more. But for now, we're just going to keep this. All right. Go back to having full blocks. Oh. Hit my desk by accident. Sorry if you guys heard that. Uh, yeah, so I definitely think a arch design would be best here. So basically, let's go over... I'm basically actually recording this the exact same day I recorded the first episode. Uh, and that's just because I'm really in a building mood today. And I really... I don't know why when I woke up I wanted to build a new city, but I definitely did. And I don't know why. I mean, Newfield, I really got tired of it. One, two, so we need three more. Uh, we need one more here. I was getting tired of Newfield, I guess, because building cities is a lot of work, especially with how much detail you want to put into them. Uh, Newfield probably took so long because probably just adding everything, all the skyscrapers took the longest. And that was because there's a lot of skyscrapers. I think Weeby Changer and I counted at one point. There's over a hundred skyscrapers on Newfield. And so there's a lot of skyscrapers, like smaller houses, stuff like that. Let's clear out some of this. So that's why I think Newfield took so long. This is going to have around the, uh, about the same amount of subscriber, or not subscribers. What? I can't talk today. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Thingies. Yes, thingies. All right, let's make another thing here. Oh. This is the one thing I don't like about clearing stuff out is on PC, this would be a lot easier, but like I said, I don't really want to use PC too much on this map. So let's just have this box over here. And then we're actually gonna make the actual, start making the actual station itself after we do this to the other side now. Boom, boom. And it comes all the way to here. Perfect. And I need to take some more swiftness again. Okay, where's my swiftness? Here it is. Okay, so let's use pillar quartz to start making, well, let me start here. So if we start here, stack this one up. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So on the eighth blocks, we're gonna put all the pillars. So then we have seven in between each. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I guess you guys could count this as a tutorial because it's basically just building a subway station. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's go other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm trying to think how I would make the arch because I don't want it to be, I've looked at a lot of designs and they all had arches. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's hard to talk and count at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm trying to think how many, uh, skyscrapers I want to bring over from Newfield. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because there are a lot of skyscrapers I do want to kind of bring over because I like the design of them. Not all of them, but most of them. I like the, de the design of them. All right, so we're starting to have our final shape here. Uh, I want to make the walls white, so we're going to use, I kind of came up with the design earlier. Uh, let's do something like this maybe. So if we take out quartz stairs, it will take a little bit longer to do all of this, but we're not going for a short amount of time. We're going for realism here and nice designs. What if we did something like this? Boom. So then we we'll probably have this be up one more block, right? That'd be my guess. We have more headroom, so more clearing out all of this crap. Yeah, this definitely, we're going to continue working on this next part. So, let's clear all this out. So, this is the only bad part about building underground, is clearing out all this, but it's definitely all worth it when it's done. If I just had, like, the commands and stuff like that that they had on PC, this would be, this wouldn't be a problem at all. We could get this all cleared out in a matter of minutes, really, depending on everything. Uh, let's just clear this stuff out for now. We can focus on the other stuff later. 
I really just want to get the wall. I want to get the wall design done so I can see what it looks like. Okay. Okay. Now let's do this again. Boom. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. There we go. Alright, so if we have that, maybe start the next one here. I was going to have them like uh, what's the word I was looking for? Like, then it would come down, but maybe this would look better. Uh, so this. So much dirt. I do like the fact that the PC can convert their worlds by default. Like, I want this many blocks of dirt. I want this many. I want that many. I want all stone. I think that's really cool. I wish we could kind of have that. And one thing I came up with, I know the reason PC has so much more stuff and commands is because they have a keyboard. Having the keyboard, we're gonna move this over a little bit, makes it to where you can have so many more buttons. The controller only has so many. So you kinda have to work with that. What they should do is make it to where you could just, uh, what's the, you plug in a keyboard to your Xbox and it does everything for you. So it's basically the exact same. I think the only problem with that is then you are kind of making it more like PC and not a console. So I'm not sure if they've considered that or if that would work at all. But if it could, I'd be kind of happy with it. So I'm not sure how that would all work. All right. Whoop. All right. So hopefully the design of the wall actually looks unique with its shape. Because this is going to go all the way around, basically. So, boom. And I love the fact that we don't have to... We can place upside down stairs a lot easier now. Because that was a huge pain in the butt. Uh, originally. But apparently that's how it was. Like, where you had to place a block and then place the stair underneath the block and all that. That's how it was on the... Uh, PC originally, so... That's how I've been told, so... I guess they're basically following the exact same I, I guess like the exact same path as PC so I think that's why Xbox is also growing like the consoles version of Minecraft it's growing a lot faster than uh, PC Minecraft is just because we already know what we need to put in to where PC it's more like okay we've already added this what can we add next and the console consoles are just like well uh, PC just got this so eventually we're gonna have it so I guess it makes things a little bit easier on 4G studios and all the companies who make Minecraft for the consoles because I think yeah 4G is making it for PS4 as well aren't they and just like PlayStation in general it's not a different company I remember there's a rumor at one point that a different company was making the PlayStation version of Minecraft so I haven't really followed up on that too much though Okay, I think we have room for one more here. Maybe two. Oh, Ajax. Oh, somebody finally woke up. So, we're almost done with this. And maybe we'll put, like, gray wool behind this as well. I feel like that would actually look pretty good here. Okay. Okay, so maybe, like, put lights in here. Hey, Jax, you're sitting in the front of the TV. Really? Nope. Nope, nope, scoot over this way. Okay. Don't like your butt in front of the TV either. Have some manners. Cats these days and animals these days. Okay. So, let's clear that out real quick. It's kind of bothering me. So, probably get like gray wool or something. Maybe different stripes of wool for each strip. There we go. It's so like this strip, since it's a little bit different, we can put something else here. Okay, this actually might work. So we can do something like this. So each strip has a different uh, color to it. I am actually might like that a lot. Okay. I don't know, I like actually using the stairs as windows now. It's unique, it has that perfect square to it. So I think that's why I kind of like using it. You're probably going to see it a lot more in builds and stuff. Oh, I need to put a piece of stone back. 
I really made this the perfect width to where I can have everything I need. Oh, I need to clear this out. So maybe red, white, and blue for the color uh, scheme of things. Just for, I don't know, America, England, whatever colors you guys have. So what colors do we want to use? Do we want to use red, white, and blue? Red, blue, maybe, let's use these. Let's use cyan, we need orange, and we need white. The colors on my channel. These are actually the colors I came up with for my channel a long time ago when I was making the logo in my Minecraft thing. I came up with this design, or this color scheme, and it actually flowed pretty well together, so let's try it. So let's break this one. This will be our white. I'm actually I'm gonna like this a lot. Perfect. Okay, so then we need white again. If we need to, we can always move the colors up to be even with the actual uh, stairs themselves. But this is I think this is kind of unique. So I'm kinda of liking that for that reason. Wait, so we need orange, okay. So white, orange, cyan. Okay, that's the pattern. Okay. Oh, there we go. God, okay, there, got it. Okay, now we need cyan. Cyan's definitely one of my favorite colors in Minecraft. Like, almost in every texture pack, it looks good. So, I think that's why I like it. Also, blue's my favorite color, and it's basically blue as well. Okay. So then we need white again. And then, is that the last one? Okay. Oh, missed one here. And now we have to figure out what we want to do with everything behind the stairs. Like, actually behind them. Maybe... Jax, can you please move, buddy? Maybe... No, that's not... Mo that's moving more in front of the TV. There you go. Stay over here. Thank you, buddy. Okay. So, you might just continue with the theme. Really, I mean, if we need to, we can always just add the quartz behind it or something. And probably should have did this beforehand. It would have been faster. Didn't think that went through, though, all the way. If I'm not, oh, if I'm being honest. Uh, put our stair back. Yeah, this would have been a lot easier if I would have just cleared all the dirt out before all this. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to think. Because I like the color theme, but I think we already have enough color. So maybe just the plain quartz behind it would look pretty good. Ooh, how about actually gray wool? Gray wool would look actually pretty good. Gray wool looks good with almost every single color in the game. So, we're probably going to put gray wool back here. Okay. So, where's gray wool? Up oh, here it is. Okay. Oof. Yeah, okay. Gray wool is going to look pretty good here. Oh. Okay, let's see. Yeah, gray wool looks pretty good. I did originally want to put... Uh, oh, we're running out of night vision. What's the word I'm thinking of? Glowstone in here? But glowstone, I've tried it before. This doesn't really shine through because it's not the full block. So you get like a little shine, but you don't get too much. So that's the only reason why I didn't do it. Because I definitely wanted to. Glowstone would have looked really good in here. The actually add light to the place, but this wouldn't w really work. And gray wool finish this up so what kind of videos do you guys want to see from me like uh 4j puts a lot of news for minecraft out on twitter and i follow them you guys want me to do like more news videos so you guys know what's coming out from minecraft stuff like that do you want to see more like house videos which you shouldn't need more of those i make a lot of those uh it's like what kind of videos really like do you want reviews do you want different games by any chance? Because I have no problem uploading different games. 
I've done it before. They don't get too many views, but some people like them, some people don't, obviously. That's just because of my channel. You want more, like, survival, hunger games, stuff like that. So just let me know, guys, so I can actually work with you guys and know what you guys want. Uh, we might be able to add more stairs here. So one, two. So I want to kind of finish up this design here. Boom, boom. Might have to make it just a little bit longer to finish out that design here in a minute. Uh, let's put our orange wool in here, though. Okay. And did we get everything? Nope, missed that. Okay. I don't know. I think this actually is looking pretty good. We have color for everything. Oh, did I? Okay, I didn't cover that up. Let's make sure I put our gray one here. To all of these real quick. Okay. And now, I'll finish it off with our orange. And, okay. There's that. That's all done. Let's back this up and look at it. I actually like that a lot. It definitely has a unique design to it. So, I'm definitely going to keep that. And basically, I'm just going to have to mirror it over to the other side. Yeah, but I like that a lot. That turned out a lot better than I thought it would, in all honesty. Uh, block of quartz goes right here. And how much time are we at? We're at 26 minutes, so probably get ready to stop it. So by the next part, I'm probably going to have a lot more of this cleared out so we can actually come up with the actual uh, like shape of the building itself. So, bye guys, thank you for watching, like always, I really like that you guys watch the videos, uh, and I like your guys' feedback always, because it lets me know how I'm doing and what you guys like, so leave your feedback, let me know what you guys want to see in the city, because I'll probably try to reply back to as many comments as possible, so bye guys, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to all you guys later, bye bye.